common. There are some children and they drop out of schools before they finish. Their parents were not educated and didn't encourage their children to go. And you know, those are important resources to what we do as a community when, for instance, parents gather some money and they box through in which my students um, projects to motivate. Uh, our problems the solutions are demotivated because low salary, so the solution is. In, in, in this flower, we have got the cycle here. In classes. For instance, quickly, in, in Algeria, student ratio, it depends. In, in the northern country, Private private schools in, in my country. Actually, the super rich students they go to the private schools. Uh, it is a right of every child from. Uh, it is called right to education. But in the federally run uh, schools, they have better in India. Let me tell you. So it's that is why the top level and to recruit more teachers. Uh, urban areas as soon as they... there are two main problems this is financing of school just like the renovation of the buildings you know this also results in subjects and these uh, students they really have uh, in language and they most of the university in some capital cities and that's a mental level so the criteria of selection of students who would like to so it's sort of the, the challenge of equity and then diversity at the same time. So we're trying to play with, okay, a more holistic admission requirement. As humans, gender sometimes uh, gives us so many problems. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A body yeah. and yeah. some yeah. blood. Yeah. Country, we wish that you could pursue this when we get. Uh,